Fellow Shelby owners, welcome to another episode of Autophone. Alex the Car Guy here, and today we're gonna be doing the oil change on the Shelby. Now, this car is known for consuming a ton of oil. How much? For about a quarter for every 500 miles of aggressive driving. That's a lot. So to keep the beast a piece, you have to make sure that you're checking your oil level frequently and doing frequent oil changes. So let's get to it. I first drain the oil by removing the oil pan plug from the composite pan. I simply use my hands or a standard 3A drive ratchet wrench. To access the oil filter on the GT350, there is a small panel located underneath the driver's side, which I open up using a T30 Torx bit. The green line on the filter canister is from factory. It shows the unit is torqued to spec. This will come in handy later. Before removing the filter, I use lots of aluminum foil to catch any dripping oil. The trick to avoiding an oil spill is to remove the canister very slowly. Once the canister is fully screwed, it will expose the filter cartridge, which I then remove by wiggling until it pops off. Now onto the fun stuff, there are two o-rings that have to be removed from the cartridge. I then clean the surfaces to make sure it's nice and clean. The new oil filter comes with new o-rings which I carefully slide into place to avoid overstretching them. Finally, I lube the O-rings with some brand new engine oil. The little O-ring that comes with the oil filter can be tossed, it is not used. Going back underneath the car, I carefully pressed in the new oil filter by hand, and then reinstall the canister cover. Here's where the green line comes in handy. I can reinstall the canister and turn it until the green lines align again, indicating it's fully seated, or I can torque the spec. I then reinstall the oil drain plug and the oil filter access cover. Time to fill the Voodoo engine with liquid gold and take this bad boy for a test drive. More Shelby videos coming your way, so consider subscribing if you haven't already, and thanks for watching.